Hey YouTube people, this is Jesse, Crave Collector 01, here today for another Transformers review. Today I'm going to be doing Transformers Dark of the Moon Lunar Fire Optimus Prime. And here is uh, Optimus Prime. This is just a, uh, well they're both Walmart exclusives. This is just the repainted version of the original Walmart exclusive, the Deluxe Dark of the Moon Optimus Prime. But he does come with the... Optimus, the Voyager Optimus Prime's mech tech weapon, and it is uh, painted. It is uh, this, just these bits here are painted with the blue and the red, and the rest is molded in red plastic, and it still is the same as the Voyager gun. It just, uh, I actually like this gun a little better. I like the detail in it, but uh, we'll move on to Prime. He's a uh, Actually, a really good representation of movie prime. To be a deluxe class figure, it's actually really well done. There are a bit of uh, problems that I do have just with this figure. And it came this way. If you look down here on the gray plastic, there is some stress marks right there. And there's some stress marks up here where you would plug in the mech tech gun. And mine come that way. The original one didn't. It didn't come that way, but this one did. And it come with the stress marks. I don't think it's going to break, but it might be something to watch out for. But there is a fair amount of paint they used on the figure. The, the gold, this is gold paint. Um, the whole silver, this is gold. The flames, or the silver is paint. The gold flames is paint. Paint, paint. Uh, the Autobot logo is painted. Flames are painted. The whole front is painted. Rims are painted. Uh, these red bits here are red painted and these are just I believe these are just molded red plastic but they used a fair amount of paint which uh, really impressed me but anyway we'll get on to the transformation to transform him what you want to do just come under here separate these legs from the two bits on the elbows well actually first what you want to do is extend the cab and it slides along this pin here and you can just pop it into place, fold that down out of the way, then fold the legs down. Fold them down, click the waist into place. It doesn't latch, it just is a post and port. Just kind of holds in there. Um, what you're going to do then is spread the legs. This uh, bit tabs into the, what would be the hip socket there. It actually plugs in, you want to pull it down, swing it up, and plug it into the upper part of the leg right there with the gray tab. Take the feet, flip them up, turn them to the side, flip that wheel under, and there you have one leg. And you come over to the other side and do the same thing. Flip up the foot, swing it sideways, flip this bit up. And there you have the leg. And then what you want to do is come up here to the arms, separate them. What I like to do is pull them both out like that. Then just take it, split it, and these two bits here tab in right there in that gray slot. So you just swing these around. Then these translucent windows here are what's going to plug into these doors. You just plug them in. Take the top section, rotate it at the waist. Fold the arms down. Flip these up just a little bit. That's what I, you don't have to necessarily do that. That's just what I like to do. Split this. Oh, he's not supposed to do that yet. You're supposed to open it. It's not supposed to do that yet. Um, then you just take this, which he does have a big, big, massive piece of cable. It's the whole front of the tractor trailer, just right here on the back. But once you fold it up and it clips into place, head will pop up, which is pretty nice. He can hold his mech tech gun, which, uh, in my opinion, I think he's just he's a little too he's a little too small to hold a gun that big but I guess he can do what he want to he what he wants to he's Optimus Prime after all you know he'll kill them all give the, give him your face he doesn't care if it's ugly or not give him your face but I like him he's pretty nice he's a really actually a really good representation of movie prime and here you can get a uh, Look at him here. Here he is next to his original self. Which I, I was noticing this guy is a fair bit amount looser. Or no. 
he's tighter. His joints are tighter. Not looser, they're tighter. They're tighter than the original. And I don't know if it's just where I've played with this one more. And maybe I've loosened it up myself. But this one doesn't have the stress marks that this one has. So if I was going to only pick one up, I would get this one. The original one. with the uh, That looks more movie accurate. This one though does look really good. Looks really good on a shelf and they look good displayed together. But if you're going to spend the money on just one, I would get... I would probably get this one, the original. But, um, so yeah, here's a quick look at the uh, Dark of the Moon Deluxe Class Lunar Fire Optimus Prime. And don't forget to visit Crave.com for all your Transformers needs. This has been Jesse, Crave Collector 01, signing off. I gotta get a secret to tell before my head explodes. I'm getting close to